it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for February 27th, 2021. Let's see. Oh, there it is. Let's see. I got a card sticking out. Our message for today is believe in the impossible blue moon. The impossible might feel like this long lost self. That version of, I was saying, I think in the weekly, you know, the original version of you, the, the God self, the, the higher frequency person that comes in ready to have this human experience and then starts getting affected by the environment or other messaging, so on and so forth. So part of the impossible is retrieving yourself, getting yourself back and watching the world change. I remember years and years ago, people were always on me about how I looked and how I needed to be different. And I said, you know what? Maybe the world needs to change because that's, that's kind of crazy. And I would get laughed at and, and people would say, oh my gosh, you expect the world to change instead of you changing? Who do you think you are? And then many years later, people started to be more open-minded about beauty and not you know, seeing it as a right to diminish people because of their looks. We've evolved a little bit. We're not quite there, but <laughs> a little bit. And that's what we're talking about here. This could be major turns or things that you're like, good luck fighting that. You know, like that's never going to change. And now we see that it is. So this is also talking about change coming about by changing ourselves and, and being our real authentic selves, as we've been saying. But if we come at something and we just want to fight it, we want to come at it with our resentment, our anger, we want to just pick a fight with somebody because they're the kind of person that's always hurt me. Bring a narcissist into my, into my realm. I've been through so much narcissistic abuse that I, I still, I'm not saying I'm like a great human being over here. I'm still learning, but I do. I, I will be like, you know, kind of honed in and be like, I see you. I see you are a narcissist. And I'm like, I want to get them, right? <laughs> But that's not going to help anything, nor should I just open myself up and be like, oh, narcissist, it's okay, come on in, you know, make me completely messed up so I have to work through this. Um, you know, that's not what we're working towards either, but rather loving ourselves. That way when we see something that might be less than love, that's manifesting in a situation, in a person, we just don't have to go there. You do that, I'm going to be over here. If you feel so inclined to say, are you aware that you're doing that? And they start being like, I'm still better than you, blah. <laughs> then you can just seal off and keep it moving. All right. So on an individual level, before we go here, I do think that this has to do with uh, some nice surprises coming our way. And this could be a surprise communication. This could be something coming to full culmination this it says blue moon but it does have this kind of like full moon feel about it where it's like you know I see it now I see what's before me so this lovely communication might be someone calling you up and being like you're awful and you did this and you did that and everything's your fault and still with the scapegoating and you know doing all this nonsense <laughs> but the beauty behind it is you're like aha I thought I would never I thought it would be impossible to figure you out and look at that. <laughs> I just got all the information I need to snip this out and keep it moving. And I just opened my life and there's going to be really beautiful things coming in for me. It's that sort of thing. So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.